Hello there, this is Teacher Josie. Welcome to my channel. Today, we are going to discuss the effects of lifestyle and the function of respiratory and circulatory system. Let's play a four picks one word. The mechanics, you will be given a set of four pictures and a set of words. Guess what does the word is based from the pictures. What's the word? The answer is asthma. Next. The answer is hypertension. Next. The answer is anemia. Let's talk about it. What idea is common in each set of pictures? So each set of pictures shows negative ways of living. Cigarette smoking, polluting the environment, eating unhealthy foods, drinking liquor, and sleep deprivation. What might happen if a person goes on with a negative lifestyle such as what we're seeing in the activity? Here are some key questions for you to ponder after finishing this video. 1. What are the effects of lifestyle in the function of the respiratory and circulatory system? What are the ways to detect and prevent diseases of the respiratory and circulatory systems? How does one's lifestyle affect the function of respiratory and circulatory systems? How can we effectively inform and encourage the public regarding the detection and prevention of respiratory and circulatory related diseases? What is respiratory disease? Respiratory disease, any of the diseases and disorders of the airways and the lungs that affect human respiration. The following, you can see the different respiratory diseases its definition, causes, symptoms, treatment, and prevention. Is circulatory disease. 
A circulatory disorder is any disorder or condition that affects the circulatory system. Circulatory disorders can arise from problems with the heart, blood vessels, or the blood itself. Disorders of the circulatory system generally result in diminished flow of blood and oxygen supply to the tissues. The following, again, are the different circulatory disorder, its definition, causes, symptoms, treatment, and prevention. must always think that you are compromising your health. Which do you prefer, healthy or unhealthy? Here are the effects of lifestyles instigated diseases that affect your respiratory and circulatory system. One is cigarette smoking. It comprises a lot of substances that are harmful to both the smoker and the individuals around the smoking. It comprises both the respiratory and circulatory framework and even the entire body. Cigarette smoking can cause respiratory illnesses by harming the parts of your respiratory system. It is increasingly regular for cigarette smokers to have lung illnesses than non-smokers. Cigarette smoking additionally represents a more serious hazard for ailments that influences the circulatory system. It is the reason behind numerous sorts of circulatory ailments, for example, stroke, hypertension, and iron deficiency. The second effects of lifestyle that instigated diseases that affect your respiratory and circulatory system is healthy diet. A healthy dieting routine does not mean you simply need to eat berries and greens but also other kinds of foods. Eating a well-balanced diet can help prevent you from having diseases. Your go-to guide on what's optimal to eat is the food pairing. Remember, you are what you eat. Next is proper hygiene. Washing your hands appropriately for 20 seconds particularly in the wake of wheezing, coughing, or cleaning out your nose, assist with shielding you and others from ailments such as colds and influenza. Protect yourself by wearing a protective mask 
this is very important especially this time that we are confronting a pandemic. Next, we have regular exercise and adequate rest. Keeping your body active can help your respiratory and circulatory system strong. As per the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention or CDC suggestions, at least 150 minutes of exercise each week improves the prevention of diseases. Let's check your understanding. Fill in the blanks using the words inside the box. Let's check your answer. Good job! Very good, you get a correct answer. Here is an example of infographic showing the effects of using cigarette. Through this infograph, we can effectively inform and encourage the public regarding the effects of using cigarettes that can cause diseases in relation to respiratory and circulatory system. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Don't forget to click like, share, and subscribe. Bye!